Today I'm going to cook stone bess marinated in sumac with beetroot risotto. This is our stone bess, which is a great alternative to sea bess, um, a sustainable fish which we should be using more of. We're going to marinate the stone bess in some diced green chilli, some sumac, some orange zest and olive oil. And we're going to serve that with a risotto um, made with beetroot, which has been roasted, uh, peeled and blended. In the risotto we're going to put white onion, an aged sheep's ricotta, which is not as strong as parmesan, which works a lot better with the fish. So I'm going to fill it this stone best now. Come under halfway through, touch the spine, remove the head, and under the gills. Just makes it a lot easier to fillet a fish if you take the head off. And come down. Back of the fish, up and under. Trim up the bass. So I'm just going to remove any small bones that run down there. Here we have our fillet of stone bass. This is two diced green chilies, about 10 grams of sumac, put that in there, and one orange zested. We'll marinate the fish for around 10 minutes. A tablespoon of olive oil into there. Give it a good mix. It's quite a dry marinade. And then simply take our fish. Gently roll it in the marinade. So we're going to leave this for about 10 minutes to marinate. The idea is to toast the grains of risotto rice. Get that nutty flavour into the risotto. So, so far I've toasted off the risotto rice and I've added half a cup of white wine now the rice has completely absorbed the white wine, I'm going to start slowly adding chicken stock. So I've got a brown chicken stock and a white chicken stock. I'm going to be using the white chicken stock because it's not as, uh, it's not as strong, the flavour's a lot more subtle, which works a lot better with the fish. So our risotto is about halfway there now. So we're shortly going to cook our fish. So when it all to come together, we want our fish to be perfectly cooked and at the same time our risotto to be al dente. It's a very hot grill. This dish would work perfectly um, on a barbecue. So we're just gonna do a few pieces this time. So just before it starts to catch, we wanna add, this is our beetroot puree, which is basically roasted beetroots in the oven for about 45 minutes around 180, 200 degrees. And then they've been peeled and blended. This is about one beetroot. Fantastic color this. Just check our fish, because it is extremely hot in here. There we go. So the skin's beautiful and crisp and uh, got that fantastic charred flavour to so the rice. It's still al dente, which is very important. It's lovely and rich with the sheep's ricotta. Definitely needs salt. A knob of butter will make it nice and velvety. So there we have our fish, which literally took one minute. Okay, so I'm going to take our beautiful beetroot risotto in the centre of the plate, which is nice and zesty with the lemon. 
This would make a perfect starter or fish course. Piece of our fish. A little bit more zest. So it's a really simple dish. But it just works really well. And then some wood sorrel. Just gives it a nice bit of colour. This is our dish. It's um, sumac marinated stone bass with a beetroot risotto.